Uh, what's up, guys? Gilo here. Uh, had a had to figure out how my camera worked again because this is the first video I've ever recorded. Uh, but anyway, I got some Zendikar Rising, and it is two for Tuesday where I open up two packs of Zendikar on Magic Arena. So let's open pack one, uh, which is a good place to start. First, and I'm going to go through these guys real quick, so pause to read about it if you want. Uh, first, we got a Tazim Royal Mage. Uh, royal Eruption. Not a royal, like, kingly, uh, but royal, like, a royal. Uh, then we got Adventure Awaits. I mean, not if you had a winning deck on Magic Arena based around Lucky Clover and then they banned it. Adventure's not awaiting now. But anyway, Expedition Healer, Cliffhaven Cell Sword. Then I got my first Sun Common Rock Slide Sorcerer. Uh, three and a red for a 3 3 Human Wizard. Whenever you cast an instant sorcery wizard spell, this deals one damage to any target. Then I got a Kaba 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 Da Kaba Da Kaba uh, In other words, I have a Kabira Plateau slash Kabira Takedown. Kabira Plateau is the land side of things. Uh, enters the battlefield tapped, and you can tap it for a white, or if you chose to play for its instance side, uh, it costs one and a white, and it deals damage equal to the number of creatures you control to target creature or player. Gotcha. And then it's almost like a white burn spell, almost. Uh, then we got, ooh, a mythic. Always like to get a mythic on Tuesdays, or any, any day, really. Uh, we got Ancient Green Warden. Is that the first one? No, sad. Uh, but 4 and 2 green for a 5-7 elemental. Uh, has reach. You may play lands from your graveyard. If a land entering the battlefield causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional time. So in other words, landfall. Uh, landfall. That's good for landfall. Landfall. Anyway, that's going to be pack one. Got another pack, isn't it? It's Tuesdays. That's what we do on on a Tuesday and every other Tuesday. Getting close to my wild card mythic. I got a wild card uncommon. That's cool. Anyway, we got a, gru a ghoul draz mucklord. What a mucklord. Mind drain. Chilling trap. Scorch rider. Uh, common wild card. And I got a Wind Rider Wizard, uh, which has to be like a uh, like an old school Metallica song, you'd think. But uh, anyway, uh, Wind Rider Wizard is two and a blue for a two-two human wizard. Has flying whenever you cast an instant sorcery or wizard spell. You may draw a card if you do discard a card. Then I got my first Kite Sail Cleric, and kind of essentially. Anyway, uh, but it's a core cleric for one red babu, babu, one white mana. And it's 1-1. One, one. has flying kicker of two and a white. Again, can't say that word. Uh, but when it enters the battlefield, if it was kicked, attack, tap, attack, a tap up to two target creatures. Seriously, what is wrong with my mouth? Ooh, my first ever nimble trap finder. It doesn't look too nimble with all that junk hanging off of him, but maybe yes, who knows. But he's one and a blue for a two, one, human rogue. Uh, it can't be blocked. Okay. Uh, if you, I thought there was more to it, but there wasn't. Uh, if you had another cleric, rogue, warrior, or wizard end of the battlefield under your control this turn. Oh, there was more to it. It can't be blocked if you had any of those come up. Uh, being of your combat on your turn, if you have a full party, creatures you control gain whenever this creature deals combat damage to a player, draw a card until end of turn. Whew. That's a lot of reading on that little blue card. Of course, it's a blue card, so what do you expect? But anyway, that's going to do it for today. Um, if you need a cool topic, tell me um, tell me your favorite card that ever had kicker, I guess. Uh, my favorite card that ever had kicker was a card I no longer. Malachar, no. It's from the first Zendikar block. It was a two-drop like 2-2 two, two Vampire, but if you played his kicker cost, which was just one more black mana, you could just, uh, a target player has to sacrifice a creature, which is a really quick way to get out a good creature that they need early on. So that's my favorite. 
But anyway, that's going to do it for today. Tune in next time for more Pack Crackers, and I'll see you then. Later.